Climate change and its effects on sea turtle reproduction and life. The process of climate change. Firstly, the Earth absorbs mostly visible light and energy from the sun. The Earth then releases that energy in the form of infrared light. However, greenhouse gases such as methane and carbon dioxide that visible light from the sun pass through but absorb infrared, li infrared light are releasing from the Earth. This causes the atmosphere to retain heat. The infrared light can be absorbed and released into the atmosphere many times before it returns to space. While this process allows the Earth to retain the heat it needs to support life, the extra greenhouse gases that humans have emitted into the atmosphere cause an extra greenhouse effect, causing the Earth to heat up above its typical te temperature. So what clock causes global warming? Um, on these graphs, the black line on both of them represents the um, observed temperature, and the green one, green line on the left graph um, represents natural factors, and the blue line on the right graph um, represents uh, human factors. So as seen on the presented graphs, natural factors are not responsible for the extra greenhouse gas emissions and resulting global warming. Humans are practically solely responsible for global warming due to greenhouse gases we have released into the atmosphere. What is carbon dioxide? Carbon dioxide, also known as CO2, is a major greenhouse gas contributor to global warming. The carbon cycle is, an, is an important to explain what carbon dioxide is. Even though there is an excessive amount of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere, the amount of carbon on the Earth has, and as, has been the same as it, is, is the same as it always has been. Carbon is in many things on the Earth, primarily rocks and sediments. The rest is stored in living beings, the atmosphere, and the ocean. The ocean is known as a giant carbon sink that absorbs carbon. Even though the amount of carbon dioxide on the Earth is the same, or even though the amount of carbon on the Earth is the same, the amount of carbon dioxide in the atmosphere has increased due to human activities, such as burning, burning fossil fuel, fuels, releasing excessive amounts of carbon dioxide, which release excessive amount of carbon dioxide into the atmosphere. So feedback loops and climate change. There are positive feedback loops, feedback loops and negative feedback loops. Positive feedback loops um, are global warming um, creates and is affected by many of them. And an example of this is in the Arctic, ice being melted by the higher temperatures and therefore reduced in coverage over the ocean. Because of ice's higher albedo and reflectiveness, it is very good at reflecting solar radiation and therefore decreasing the he heating of the Earth from the sun. However, when this global warming heats up the Earth, the ice melts and is less effective at reflecting the sol solar radiation, leading to even higher temperature temperatures, and so on and on. These um, negative feedback loops occur when climate change decreases the severity of itself. An example of this is evaporation. While the temperature of the Earth increases from human activity, the ocean's evaporation rate increases because of the increase in temperature and it releases more moisture into the atmosphere. And causing Earth's temperature to decrease slightly. Some common misconceptions about climate change. There are many con common misconceptions about climate change. For example, many people believe that climate, is just, climate change is just part of the natural cycle of Earth. However, the past 150 years of climate change since the Industrial Revolution have been exceptional in climate warming and cannot be natural when compared to Earth's climate history. Another common misconception about um, climate change is that carbon dioxide emissions do not lead to climate change because carbon dioxide is only a small part of the atmosphere. However, it has been proven again and again by scientists that carbon dioxide causes a healing effect, when a heating effect, when exposed to sunlight. The excess amount of carbon dioxide emissions from fossil fuel burning does in fact lead to a heating effect on Earth. A final common misconception regarding climate change is that we're using is that using single-use plastic and ocean pollution contributes to global warming. While ocean pollution is bad for the environment, it does not have any connection to global warming. Global warming is caused by atmospheric pollution and is not linked to ocean pollution. Effects of climate change on human society. Um, firstly, agriculture. Global warming has dealt a major blow on agriculture. For example, US, US crop farms, which supply nearly 25% of all grains globally, globally have been prevented from growing because of higher temperatures and participation. Furthermore, they are at higher risk of being wiped out by the extreme weather events, especially floods and droughts because of global warming. Electricity. In warmer climates, demand for electric devices such as air conditioning will increase, and the use of natural heating such as burning wood will decrease. It is expected that demand for cooling and electricity will be increased by 5-20% to 20 per 1.8 degree Fahrenheit increase of the nation's temperature. A social justice is issue involving climate change, which is the economy. 
Climate change affects the economy in many different ways. It causes injustices to some families who depend on the climate for income, such as agriculture workers who require specific temperatures to grow and sell crops. With global warming, these workers may struggle to produce needed income for themselves and their families. In addition, climate change may affect tourism in certain areas, such as ski resorts that require low temperatures to be in business. Another way that climate change affects the economy is related to insurance. Because of the increased frequency and extremity of natural disasters, insurance for these accidents have become less available and affordable in many areas. How does climate change affect sea turtles' reproduction in life? So global warming greatly affects um, sea turtles and other marine animals. The rate of global warming exceeds the rate of the animal's ability to adapt to such extreme changes in their environment. Firstly, the overpopulation of females. The sex of a sea turtle offspring is affected by the environment its leg is laden, egg is laden, and including temperature. Hotter sand temperatures have led to an increase in female sea turtle population and a decrease in males. A recent study in Australia found that 99% of green sea turtles around Rain Island were female. This is an obvious risk for sea turtle populations because they cannot reproduce without male sea turtles, leading to a large decrease in sea turtle reproduction and population. So how does climate change affect, affect sea turtles' reproduction in life? Again, so migrational issues. Many sea turtles mi migrate to find prey. Global warming affects these migrational turtles by altering um, currents they use as well as the impact and as well as impact the abundance of prey. The results in southern species of sea turtles being found in the, this results in southern species of sea turtles being found in more northern areas. So their habitat also global warming is responsible for a negative impact on sea turtles' habitat. Without proper nutrition and harmed habitat for for more extreme weather conditions and rising sea levels, sea turtles are being endangered throughout all of their lifespan. A social justice issue involving sea turtles is that sea turtles and other marine animals being put at, are being put at risk of lowering populations and it poses a threat to human fishing industries that rely on sea turtles to protect their habitat and therefore animals that live there so the animals can survive and be used for profit in the case of these fishing industries. For example, the ho hawksbill sea turtle is an important um, turtle for maintaining sea sponge populations in many coral reefs. Because of these industries, because these industries rely on sea turtles, there are many issues that may arise from the endangerment of sea turtles due to climate change and other factors. This is an image of a hawksbill sea turtle. So thank you for watching. Um, the sources are in a separate document in Google Classroom.